So today I'm in Las Playitas and I really love this village. I'm going to show you around. It looks like uh, a little bit like Greek, like Santorini. It's all white and blue. It's really amazing. So basically, there is different levels in this village. I'm quite in the middle right now, but I'm going to go down to show you the like the seafront. Look these little streets. It's really beautiful. Like all the people have the door, the house open. Like they don't care, you know. So first, by going this way, I'm going to show you, like there is like a little harbor. There are some people, but it's not really touristy. Look, this kind of architecture white and blue looks like a little bit like Lanzarucci I was in Lanzarucci well, last week it's gonna look the same look. there is a little shop Look at this view. Look. So this is Las Playetas. Well, we are right now at low tide. I'm not a professional, but I, I try to... I feel like I can recognize when it's high tide or low tide. Look at this view. It's crazy, isn't it? There is someone fishing right there and here you can see all the water is really it's really clear it's amazing so when i told you the village is built like uh, with different levels you can clearly see it right now so the village basically is in two parts you have the first part here like the whole town and here on this side you have like a resort it's like a big hotel and actually Las Playitas is really famous for this hotel this place because it's like there is a lot of people doing sport training for triathlon all of kind of sportive are athletes are coming here and Basically, they are spending months training in this area. So basically, Las Playitas is a fishing village. It just recently opened up a little bit of tourism, not that much, but uh, without losing the cultural place and whole town. Very nice. So I'm going to walk you along the shore here and then we are going to go inside the town. Look at the streets. It's so beautiful right there. Look. That's crazy. It's wonderful. 
Look at this house, it's amazing. So right now, look at the heart watch. So right now I'm going to show you the little streets like this here we have just behind me the ocean here but this is like construction but we go here inside oh there is a lot of stairs in this village like a lot so if you have some mobility problem it's not going the best place to stay Look at this street with like the the blue and white wall. It's really amazing. Yeah. Basically, it looks like you are in someone terrace. carry on I'm going to go this direction the stairs I don't know if I'm entering in someone's house or... the door is open okay I don't know if I'm allowed to be here yeah basically let's go back I'm going to walk you in this little street right there Let's go left. Going left, we can find in the street where I was. And then, well, of course there, is, there are some stairs. And today it's really hot. Like uh, the sun is burning. Okay. Here. Well, right now I'm not going to the third spot. I'm going to stay at this level and uh, I'm going to show you a viewpoint that's very amazing. Have a look at this little door and the hole in the hole. Walls. Look, there is a bricks. You can go on top. Let's have a look at this part of the Pueblito, little village. streets it's so typical I love the walls like this looks like white blue and you have the green the ground is green look at this scenery amazing 
Las Playitas. So, Las Playitas, if you want to find it, it's really close to Grand Tarajal. It's on the east coast. And it's really like paradisite. I really love this place. Last time I came, I spent about almost three days here. Two to three days, I don't remember exactly. Uh, I'm back on the, like on the sidewalk here on the shore. Seems like today all the restaurants are closed. It's Thursday today, so I don't know why, but looks like it. Everything is closed. So be careful if you want to come on Jueves. Okay, there is another viewpoint. I'm going to go up. I'm going to show you around. I guess I remember there is a really strange house here. Yeah, basically the guys, the guy living in this house have like a really strange backyard. Like the garden is really like an horror movie, you know? Looks like voodoo magic power, I don't know, something like that. Have a look. Really, really strange things going on here. And then on the other side of the stairs, here you can see the skulls of some goats or... Yeah, I think it's goats. Well, it kind of reminds me of the Villa Tabaiba in Corralejo. I don't know if you know it. But it's like the, the house of an architect and he built really strange things around the house. I'm almost at the top. This is the direction. And from here you have really like a, a magnificent viewpoint. It's really amazing. Have a look. Have a look. So here, on the left side, you have the whole town and on the right side, you have the resort, the hotel, where all the athletes are going to train off-season. So it's really like a big boot camp, I can tell. Ok amigos, I'm going to show you some other parts of Las Playitas. I'm going to go a little bit higher in the, in the little village. So I'm going to show you what it looks like from the top. And there are so many little streets, you can lose yourself inside, it's like a maze. It's really amazing. recommend to come here and to spend at least one full day even if there is not a lot of things to do like the vibes the ambient uh, the ambience it's really amazing so now we're going to take stairs again but this one was like really destroyed as you can see So here, yeah, this is, I think this is the house of the uh, 
of the backyard. Okay. 2011. Have a look. How beautiful it's. Yeah. It's really hot. I'm sweating. Let's change the hands. Whew. But oh, it's really beautiful. <laughs> like that. Okay, so here we are. Stress. That doesn't look like looks like a Spanish name. <laughs> Let's carry on going higher in the village. I can't imagine the view you can have from the houses on the top. It should be really beautiful. to catch my breath so if you want to visit something really interesting just nearby it's the lighthouse of La Entallada El Faro de La Entallada and it's really amazing the architecture of the lighthouse is just really beautiful it's a place you should go but there is a catch that's not really a catch, but the road to access the lighthouse it's super super steep and scary because the road is really narrow so it's quite difficult okay, look how beautiful look how beautiful Casa Mirador. Mirador means viewpoint. Well, I guess you can see some pretty thing from up there. Here, it's very nice. Let's carry on. Guys, I think it's a dead hand. Yeah, let's go back. I remember the visual nice view from one of the door here let's see if I can see it oh yeah you see you see what I mean yeah have a look it's beautiful it's beautiful there is another place I want to see Everything is white. So I'm basically almost at the top of the village. Wow, look at this house. Casa Janars, Janars. Look. Yeah, there is a big, I think it's a, it's a golf course. Look at the village. So now, <laughs> I almost fell. So now we're going back downstairs there is nobody I don't know if you like it I love it oh, it's beautiful. the architecture is very really beautiful here Calle Santa Lucia look at the house I love how they made the wall like with the all the bumps so here there is an access? No, I don't think so. I'm not sure. I'm going to have a look. Because I know there is a way to go down, but I'm not sure if this way I'm not sure about if this is like a Yeah, this is one this is a pre private house. I remember. So it's the other way around. 
Damn, it's really hot right now. And now on the top of that I'm walking up, walking down like that. <laughs> so it's not helping. Yeah, look at the view. Just look at the view. Well, forget the car. Yeah, for your information, we can see down there there is a spa. Well, in France we call it spa. Here in the Canary Island they call it Padilla. This is the same name because when you look at the at the ad, it say like Padilla Spa. So I don't know which one is the good one, but here it's Padilla. Look at the view. I'm going to take a photo real quick. with all the flowers, the white houses you can see the ocean in the background it's like a good mix of everything good up this way let's carry on Damn, I'm sweating, it's really hot. Maybe there is a good probability I can go and take a jeep. I don't know. It's better to go down this stair <laughs> than to going up this stair. Have a look. <laughs> There is a car coming. Okay, let's go this direction. I'm not sure where this direction is leading. Okay, I get it. I'm going to walk to the port. The harbor. Have a look here. I'm going this way, it's very really beautiful. Up. Okay, guys, I'm going to end the video here. I hope you like it. And if you want to go, if you want to come to this little village, be sure to send me a message on YouTube a comment and I will respond no problem thank you bye